start. And they're off for the Mansion Bet hashtag getting ready for Cheltenham. Novices hurdle over two and a half miles. Castle Robin, special buddy. And their first flight of hurdles. And all jump it safely. Still well bunched. Castle Robin in the maroon jacket with the beige star disputing it. The red cap of special buddy. They're one and two. Very warm towards the rear in two shades of blue is Midnight Glance. They've done their jumping over on the far side first time round. Next flight will be at the bottom end of the race course. And on the inside it's Prince Llewellyn who's come through under David Bass to shade it from Castle Robin. Uh, hunting up the leading pair. What a Baloo in the first time visor next in the field. Closely followed by Torn and Freight, saving ground against the fence, and Chancier continues to race wide. It's just ahead of Midnight Glance. Swinging, Dagano just tracking Castle Robin in the centre, and Chancier a length or so further back. Still on the inside is Torn and Freight, alongside Waterbaloo. Midnight Glance, the back marker. Over the flight will be the last next time round. This special buddy relegated to fifth as they make this run out towards the far side of the course. And chance here and the pushed along Waterbaloo, the next pair. And Midnight Glance now detached by three lengths at the back of the field. Swinging right handed, heading out towards the far side of the course. Racing past their departure points. And it's still Prince Llewellyn and Castle Robin. There's been precious little between the pair from the start. Dagano, far side of Prince Llewellyn. Prince Llewellyn emerged just in front. Torn and Freight and Dagano and Special Buddy are in line behind the leaders. Just a couple of lengths away. Three lengths to Enchance here. Still driven along his Wadabaloo. And then there's a further two lengths here. Hasn't lost any further ground, but he's pushed along as they make the run towards the end of the back straight. Still quite a run before they leave the ground again. Midnight Glance has lost touch. And uh, Wadabaloo is driven firmly and is a good 12, 15 length out, and there it was Castle Robin, a little out to the left was Dagano, but he moved up sides, Torn and Freight responding to pressure and keeping on gamely, having been driven, having made a mistake on the far side, Prince Llewellyn completes the leading quartet, they're in line for home into second place, Castle Robin now drops back in third as they swing for home, and Dagano making a beeline towards this near side lead from Torn and Freight down towards the centre of the course, coming towards two out, Dagano by a good three or four lengths, just hesitated going into it, but Torn and Freight landed flat footed in second but he is staying on then the sixth lens to Castle Robin who looks booked for third barring accidents Dagano with the lead Torn and Freight not going down without a fight a length or so between them over the last Dagano from Torn and Freight they're 12 lengths cleared of Castle Robin in third it's Dagano kept up to his work as they race towards the finishing post it's Dagano from Torn and Freight Torn and Freight has battled on well but he's fighting a losing battle and Dagano opens his account beats Torn and Freight Castle Robin was third and keeping on for fourth Lace was Prince Llewellyn.